The JS Hagero DDG-180 represents a significant evolution in the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force's naval capabilities. As the second vessel in the Maya class of guided missile destroyers, Hagero serves as a testament to Japan's advanced naval engineering and its commitment to modernizing its maritime defense. Named after Mount Hagero, one of the three mountains of Diwa in Yamagata Prefecture, this warship embodies both technological sophistication and symbolic cultural heritage. The Maya-class destroyers were conceived as an enhancement of the Atago-class destroyers, which themselves were derived from the Congo-class warships. The JS Hagero, along with its sister ship JS Maya, DDG-179, was constructed by Japan's Universal Shipbuilding Corporation in Yokohama. The Hagero was laid down on January 23, 2018, launched on July 17, 2019, and officially commissioned in 2021, following the commissioning of JS Maya in 2020. These ships represent the cutting edge of naval warfare technology, integrating systems designed to address the multifaceted threats of modern maritime combat. Under standard load, the Hagero displaces 8,200 tons, with a full load displacement of 10,250 tons. The ship measures 557.4 feet in length, has a beam of 72.9 feet, and a draught of 21 feet. Propulsion is provided by a combined gas, electric, and gas system, featuring four IHI LM2530 gas turbines that collectively produce 68,010 horsepower. This setup allows the destroyer to reach speeds of up to 30 knots, offering excellent mobility and range for both high-speed engagements and fuel-efficient cruising. The Hagero accommodates approximately 300 crew members and supports a variety of operations with its stern-based helipad and attached hangar, which can house and maintain a Navy helicopter. The vessel also carries a rigid hull inflatable boat for boarding and other small-scale missions. The ship's radar and sensor systems include the AN-SPY-1D Passive Electronically Scanned Array Radar, AN-SPQ-9 Surface Search Radar, and the AN-SQQQ-89 Anti-Submarine Warfare Suite, providing robust situational awareness and target acquisition capabilities. The Hagero's primary armament reflects its emphasis on missile-based warfare. It features a 127mm L64 Mach 45 Mod 4 gun on the forecastle, two Phalanx 20mm close-in weapon systems for close-range defense, and both 64-cell and 32-cell vertical launching systems fore and aft. These VLS configurations allow the ship to deploy a variety of missiles, including the SM-2MR standard missile, the SM-3 anti-ballistic missile, the SM-6 standard missile, and the Type Euro 7 VL ASROC anti-submarine weapon. Additional armament includes two missile launchers for Type 17 weapons and two Type 68 triple torpedo tubes for addressing surface and underwater threats. A key feature of the Hagero is its integration of the Aegis Combat System, a state-of-the-art maritime warfare platform that enhances its ballistic missile defense capabilities. The ship's stealthy design incorporates signature reducing features to minimize detection by adversaries, reinforcing its role as a frontline defense asset. The JS Hagero has already demonstrated its advanced capabilities in real-world scenarios. During the 2022 Pacific Dragon exercise, the Hagero participated in a series of high-profile missile defense drills. On November 18, 2022, it successfully fired an SM-3 Block IB missile, intercepting a target outside the atmosphere at the Pacific Missile Range Facility in Hawaii. This marked a critical milestone in validating the ballistic missile defense systems of the Maya-class destroyers, alongside JS Maya, which had similarly intercepted a target with an SM-3 Block 2A missile two days earlier. These exercises underscored Japan's increasing proficiency in missile defense, achieved through close cooperation with the U.S. Navy and the U.S. Missile Defense Agency. In addition to these exercises, the Hagero has been actively deployed in joint training exercises and patrols 
that emphasize interoperability with allied forces. This includes frequent operations with the United States and other regional partners, reflecting Japan's strategy of fostering strong defense alliances to counterbalance growing regional threats. Such collaboration enhances both the ship's operational readiness and the JMSDF's integration into multinational security frameworks. The JS Hagaro plays a pivotal role in Japan's modern maritime defense strategy. As a cornerstone of the JMSDF's Aegis-equipped fleet, it enhances the nation's capacity to counter regional threats, particularly in light of the growing missile capabilities of neighboring countries such as China and North Korea. The ship's BMD capabilities provide a critical layer of defense against ballistic missile threats, contributing to the broader regional security architecture. When compared to regional rivals, the Hagaro holds its own as a formidable platform. For instance, China's Type 0 5E2D destroyers boast comparable displacement and armament, but lack the proven track record of interoperability with allied forces that the Maya class enjoys. Similarly, South Korea's Sejong the Great class destroyers are heavily armed but are deployed in smaller numbers. The Hagaro's Aegis system, coupled with its integration into joint exercises and operations, provides a qualitative edge in collaborative defense efforts. Moreover, the Hagaro's Koglag propulsion system offers an enhanced fuel efficiency and operational flexibility, enabling the ship to undertake prolonged missions without compromising speed or maneuverability. This is particularly advantageous in the vast expanse of the Indo-Pacific region, where naval assets must cover extensive operational areas. Looking ahead, the JS Hagaro is expected to play a critical role in Japan's evolving maritime defense posture. The ship's advanced capabilities make it a key asset in deterring potential aggressors and safeguarding vital sea lanes that are crucial for Japan's economic security. As regional tensions persist, the Maya-class destroyers, including the Hagaro, are likely to be central to joint initiatives aimed at ensuring freedom of navigation and maintaining a rules-based international order. Japan's emphasis on integrating cutting-edge technology into its naval fleet reflects its broader philosophy of maintaining a defensive posture that is both robust and adaptive. The Hagaro exemplifies this approach, combining state-of-the-art systems with a focus on interoperability and strategic partnerships. These qualities position the ship not only as a guardian of Japanese sovereignty, but also as a symbol of the nation's commitment to regional peace and stability. The JS Hagaro, DDG-180, epitomizes Japan's commitment to maintaining a modern, capable, and interoperable maritime force. Its advanced systems, proven operational record, and strategic deployment underscore its value not only as a national defense asset, but also as a contributor to regional stability. In an era of evolving security challenges, the Hagaro and its sister ship, JS Maya, solidify Japan's position as a leader in maritime defense technology and strategy. The combination of cutting-edge design, powerful armament, and active participation in joint defense efforts ensures that the Hagaro will remain a cornerstone of Japan's naval capabilities for years to come.